Hi guys! So today is the last day of the year, 2015 that is, and it's about 10:38 uh, now, so it's almost 11 p.m. And here I am talking to you, my last video of the year. So if you guys are wondering, what am I doing here? Why don't I go outside partying and all that with the rest of the people? It's because I'm just a very private person, I guess, and I don't like crowd. So I would rather just be at home and do a movie marathon, especially I'm still catching up on my Doctor Who marathon. And I'm not a big fan of a firework or anything like that, so it's all good. And I need to catch up on my rest as well. So yeah, I know, so boring, but that's how I roll, yo! So yeah, now, so today's video is all about self-reflex. I know there's probably tons of other YouTubers that will do the same thing as well, but I thought this is my way to to get more personal with you guys and do more blogging with you guys i think i will be doing more blogging style of videos in the future so i really do hope that you guys will enjoy this kind of video i guess it's my way to show you guys my other side of life so it's not just all about baking and cheesecake and all that it's other stuff as well like my holiday or my weekend or even my hobbies and everything so you already got a glimpse of that from my couple of videos um in the past couple of weeks time my obsession with doctor who my catching up with the blogging and also you know that i take you guys to my recent trip as well to bali and to singapore and i'm really enjoyed making or editing that kind of video so i hope that you guys enjoy that too so yeah now back to the topic so today's video is all about 2015 and 2016 so 2015 is all about reflecting what have I done so far with 2015 and what do I want to achieve in 2016 as it's simple as that 2015 I don't know I guess 2015 I already prepped myself that it's going to be an awesome year for me which is good what I'm going to do for 2016 as well so 2015 I believe that it was a good year because I keep thinking that in the back of my head that it is a good year it's a good year hi emily and you know what and it's good so that's why until now i still believe that it's a good year even though despite the fact that i had a breakup in the beginning of the year which you guys don't know anything about it because i never actually show um to you guys that i'm sad or anything i don't want to say that it was a bad breakup or anything like that it's just a breakup really but i've been with this person for quite a long time I'm not talking about a year or two years or anything like that we're talking about like more than seven years that's crazy and of course it's not something that i can just get over with straight away or anything like that it's a process and definitely you know um, if if I choose to be depressed the whole year that I can definitely easily go through that road But I just don't want to do that. I would rather be happy than to be depressed and upset about life. So That's why you never see me upset in photos in Instagram or even in videos and everything like that It's because of that and the other thing what happened to me is that my car got flooded it was a flash flood as well um sort of in the month of may or june or something like that it was crazy it was a crazy experience and people will think of it as like oh my god that's such a horrible experience to have for me that's pretty cool i mean on that day of course it was really scary because it was so real and the water keeps on rising up and i got stuck in the middle of that flood and we actually have to cross the river and I mean that month was started to get really cold as well so it's like an episode of a movie and the way that I see it is like oh my god I'm actually experiencing this and I get to to see other people helping other people and that's what I like as well about I guess the community Brisbane community is that when you get into that kind of situation people will definitely be there for each other and they will help you no matter what no matter if if you're asian or if you're white or if you're rainbow or whatever they will be there they will be there for you to to help you even just to hold your hand to go across the river or to go across those bloody um water stream that's gone crazy and all that and that is really cool giving umbrellas and everything i mean i still have that a random person umbrella in my garage at the moment and I don't even know how to return it and that's crazy I can easily take that as a bad thing as well but no I just take that as an experience and 
hi is a cool experience to tell in the future as well so at least i experienced that like i said i don't really want to focus on negative things about life i just i would rather just be all positive and be all like you know life and take a good thing about it so that's what i've been doing this whole years and i'm really glad that i did that and i hope you guys can see that too that i've been very happy and i've been good well especially from the breakup i learned um to love myself again and i learned to be more positive i learned um that nothing is or no one is holding me back now and i can be as expressive as i want it to be and that's a good thing also it motivate me as well to be fitter um to be more expressive and just have more of myself really than have to think about compromising with someone else just because we're in a relationship or something like that this relationship or breakup thing turned out to be a good thing so i win yeah so that's basically the highlight of my 2015 it's all about that kind of drama but like i said it's not like a bad drama or anything really it's all about self-discovery it's all about zen yes indeed now 2016 what do i want from 2016 i want everything to be honest and like what i said as well in the beginning is that i believe that 2016 will be an awesome year for me it will be the year of my everything that i will get everything that i want so i will get fitter and i will get i don't know just be more successful just be more happy find love maybe i don't know um i'm not going to focus on the bad thing life is too short really and i just want to be happy and it goes the same way with you guys i want you guys to be happy as well and if you guys think that you guys have no one to turn to or anything like that private message me i'll be there for you guys i'll, I'll talk with you and everything just because i don't believe that you're alone in this world you have your parents you have your friend you have your siblings you must have someone out there even like a help hotline or anything like that i'm pretty sure there there will be a, a help hotline in your country somewhere out there as well but if you guys don't have any of that like i said pm me and i'll talk to you guys so yeah it's not like i have plenty of friends or anything like that i'm a loner as well if you want to call it that way but i believe that i do have a couple of um, good friends or best friends even that I'm that I can proudly say that they are my best friend because they will be there for me and have my family as well as a support as well um, I have my sister I have my brother I have my mom and dad and I have my baby niece as well so yeah if I have a bad day at work then I will body you know I will pick up my baby niece from a daycare and then I will give her the biggest hug ever and then um, her face when she see me picking her up from a daycare is priceless is the best thing in the world and that will melt all my trouble my everything away believe me it's like an unconditional love that she display on her face is so intense it's just so i don't know it's just very happy it's not like i'm bragging about my baby niece or anything i love her to death but the point of the story is that i'm pretty sure you will have a way to to make yourself happy or anything like that so that's why 2016 is basically just to be happier just to to be i don't know more in everything just to be become um you know to become a better person and be more successful like i said in everything hopefully i am spreading love and peace to everyone as well because i do believe i'm all about love and peace i probably was a very angry person back in the day but not anymore so okay i better stop rambling before i say something that i will regret for the rest of my life <laughs> okay so if you guys like today's video don't forget to like and subscribe if you guys already done that guys thank you so much for doing that i really appreciate it as usual and don't forget the giveaway competition thing is still going on at the moment so if you guys missed that don't forget to go and watch my giveaway um, video 
thing which I will leave the link by the end of this video and if there's any questions or any feedback or anything leave it on the comment section below as well and the question of the day will be what is your new year resolution please share that with me leave it on the comment section below and you know even if you just want to talk or chat or whatever leave it on the comment section below and i will try to reply to it as soon as i can so i guess that's it guys so i hope you guys have a good new year's and yeah <laughs>